Hi, I'm Mark. I'm the Executive Director of the Iowa Bicycle Coalition. We're up here at Balltown, Iowa. This is one of the highest peaks along the Mississippi and home of Bright Box, the oldest restaurant that's west of the Mississippi. Uh, that was built here in 1853. It's been rebuilt a couple times, uh, but it's a great place to uh, dine. Uh, this uh, bicycling magazine the best ride in America, one of the 50 best rides in America, and I don't doubt it. This is a this is an outstanding ride I'm ended. Uh, Balltown, Cheryl, Sageville. We're going to have a good downhill route going home. Thanks a lot. I'm in Cheryl, Iowa. This is uh, halfway on the uh, ball town from Dubuque, uh, Dubuque route. Right behind me is the Black, uh, Black Horse Inn? Yes. Black Horse Inn. And it was built in 1856. Right now it's a food and lodging place. So really interesting stop halfway uh, right here in Cheryl on the uh, Dubuque to ball town route. We're in Sageville now. This is the end of the route just before we get to Dubuque. And this is on the Mississippi River Trail, part of the trail that runs from the headwaters in Minnesota all the way down to the Gulf of Louisiana. Right here on the Heritage Trail. And this is where we end up on this uh, great bike route from uh, uh, Balltown to Dubuque. Uh, Heritage Trail runs all the way from Dyersville uh, up to uh, Sageville. And we're going to go into Dubuque across a new uh, uh, Highway 52 for pass. So a new section of the trail that takes us right down to downtown Dubuque. This is the Highway 52 overpass. This takes us uh, over the busier highway that connects the Heritage Trail to downtown. 